prescribed burning or controlled burns as we often call them are um, areas that we choose to burn under certain weather conditions. Those are days when we know that we can get the smoke up and away from sensitive areas that may be impacted by smoke. Those are days that we know we can keep that fire safely inside a fire line as to not impact local residents in some of these areas. When we apply fire to a, a specific area in a controlled burn or a prescribed fire, what we see is a reduction in the, the leaves and the twigs and the dead matter that collects on the forest floor. Um, we've reduced what we call fuel on the ground. By doing that, uh, we also provide an opportunity for various flowers and grasses and things to emerge from the ground because we've uncovered them and their seed source. We've also provided sunlight for, uh, through the forest floor to hit the ground and warm the ground and allow for those seeds to grow. The Southern Blue Ridge Tracks is in this area for many reasons, but one important reason is for our Table Mountain Pitch Pine communities. Table Mountain Pine requires fire to open the cone and inside that cone is a seed and that fire opens the cone and the seed can drop to the forest floor. And that allows that seed to have a great place to germinate and produce a new forest. From a wildlife standpoint, there's, there are numerous benefits. What I like to say is we're putting groceries on the ground. You know, wildlife benefit from a number of, of things in terms of insects, uh, soft mast, hard mast, um, nesting habitat, breeding habitat, those types of things. And we've also made it safer for first responders or firefighters that may come out and may be responding to a wildfire event, making it safer in terms of making a potential wildfire in the future easier to control, easier to contain, and taking the intensity of a potential wildfire down to something that's a lot more manageable.